drawn it and tonally worked out the values. I then kind of will, will focus on the eyes, especially on some of the bigger pieces where it's just one, one portrait. And that is like the beginning of the actual meat of the painting, if you like. Without that, yeah. as soon as I know that that's working, mm -hmm. then I know that the painting is going to be a success. Yeah. So it's, it's just about the eye, and it's always for me, it's a focus. There will be, it's almost like that perfect imagery of you know looking at where something is set, how yeah. it's composed. It's that's the focus, and then everything else kind of comes around, around it. it. Yeah. 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 You do some big pieces. Everything that I do has an element of design. It's you know even if I'm looking at an image of, of a house, it's got to be cropped in a way that is interesting to me. That maybe cuts the you know one of the hands in half. You don't see the whole image. Yes. It's it, then that then there's something that draws your eye in, and so there's a, there's always a design element and there's always a narrative because you can't help being a, an illustrator. Someone you know you're still going to have that coming through even as a painter, mm -hmm. and therefore I think that's where the the story comes into it. And people look at them and don't just see it as a this is an animal, this is a dog, this is a horse. It's got something that means something.